everyone. Welcome to today's episode of Perspectives. I am so thrilled. I think I said every time, but I'm particularly thrilled about today's guest. We are going to be meeting Dr. Richard Schwartz, who is the, uh, he's on the faculty of the Department of Psychiatry at Harvard Medical School. He was associate professor in the Department of Psychiatry at the University of Illinois at Chicago's Institute for Juvenile Research and later at the Family Institute at Northwestern University. Richard began his career as a systemic family therapist and academic. So his background is definitely in family therapy. He's very familiar with attachment theory. Now, he has developed this methodology, this beautiful body of work. It's grounded in systems theory and he's developed a therapeutic technique called internal family systems therapy or IFS also known as parts therapy. And he developed this and he shares at the beginning of our conversation how it came about. He was working with clients who claimed to recognize they had several components or sub-personalities or parts within themselves, which is separate from having multiple personalities. It isn't that. So he began to focus on these relationships amongst the parts within his clients. And he began to notice that there were systemic patterns in the way they were organized in every client. He observed that his client's parts were often rebellious or troublesome or overly controlling. And when they weren't attended to, uh, they could get a little out of control. So if you've ever had part of you that perhaps flares up a little bit too much or part of you that's over controlling or needs, you've got the perfectionist streak in you or you're a little bit too anxious for the occasion or you find yourself particularly reactive, well, this is really for you because what Schwartz observed is that if we paid attention to our internal narrative and we really tapped into the truth of us, there was an essence of us, a truth to us, a truer self amongst all the anxiety or the controlling or the playing out or the anger or whatever it was. And there was a beautiful self within. And that if we can have our parts feel safe and when they're allowed to relax, and when the clients are allowed to experience their truest self and begin to realize they can trust themselves and love themselves and feel compassion for themselves, that whole beautiful journey to self-compassion, then what can happen spontaneously is the qualities of confidence and openness, compassion, love, clarity, calm, courage begin to show up. And it's in all of us, no one's the exceptions. So from this, beginnings of working with clients and these beautiful discoveries, internal family systems or IFS came about in the eighties. I love it because it's non-pathologizing. It's really aligned with coaching. It is based on truth. It's based on honesty, encouragement, and acceptance of all of us and true compassion at the deepest level. There's no judgment. There's no rejection. There's no pathologizing any of it. And that through this journey of acceptance, and compassion and embracing us with a technique. And in the podcast, Dick works with me as a client and you will see the technique play out, how we can be in touch with our truest selves, that centered self that's in all of us and reach out to a part of us that's perhaps felt not as loved. We can reach out to it with love and you'll see in that it's real, it's not a role play as I do that. And the beautiful consequence of that, when that part realizes it, it is loved and accepted and hasn't been rejected. It's now evidence-based. IFS is evidence-based. It's become widely used as a form of psychotherapy. Uh, you'll hear in the podcast how uh, it's going to be brought to coaches, which I think is really exciting. He's published a ton of books. One of the books that I've devoured, and you'll hear on the podcast, I've read this a number of times, is Internal Family Systems Therapy by Schwartz and Sweezy. The Mosaic Mind, I must say, is a little bit more for the therapist, so it wasn't really applicable to me as much. Internal Family Systems Therapy by Schwartz. He's also got a beautiful audible that I do mo parts of it most days called uh, Greater Than Some of the Parts. Uh, he's done other works as well. And I, I, he's also got courses available online at the moment. The beautiful thing about this is his energy. You're going to I'm sure feel as I did with him. He's got a really great energy, a beautiful energy. He's a very open soul, very accessible to chat with about it. And we have quite a long conversation about IFS. We unpack what it is, what the parts are and their different functions within us, what our centered self is and how important it is to recognize this in all of us. 
we talk about how we can bring it into our daily practice and then what we do is we look at how we can bring it alive in our coaching practices as well if you're a coach i believe it's fabulous for leaders for parents for anyone who wants to relate at a different level and i believe its truest gift is its compassionate pathway to ourself and so here he is the man himself dr richard swartz <laughs>